Bro, peep this weather, bro. Oh my days. What is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today, we are picking up the Adidas Yeezy Boost 350 blue tints. Um, so crazy story is, me and Juanito went around the whole entire DC, Maryland, Virginia, basically, and joined as many raffles as we could, tried our luck. I, I myself joined 10 different raffles, and I just happened to win with a finish line. So it's super early, it's about 9 a.m., and pickup for those sneakers is from 8 to 10. So we're going to Pentagon City Mall right now. It's freezing cold and we're picking up our Yeezys for retail. So let's go ahead and do it. I'll take you guys along, let's go. All right guys, so I just got to Pentagon and you know what's crazy about US malls is you can go to the, you can go inside the mall two hours before the actual mall opens up in the philippines they will make you wait outside before you can go in and it's an hour it's 9 a.m and the mall opens at 10 and this parking lot is filled already with shoppers and it's crazy man like people are really packing up the mall before the mall even opens and i guess everyone's just doing their christmas shopping right now so um, yeah, let's go ahead and head to finish line. So there's literally no one here yet There's finish line right there Hi there, how are you doing? Pick it up the Yeezys. Name? Uh, Ralph uh, Perteria, here you go Thank you Packaging for this one is different too, right? Orange box. Really? Orange box. Congratulations. Yeah, it's an orange box. It comes um, with the dust bags or anything like that? No, it's just it's just the shoe. It's just yeah. basically like the sixes, but just an orange box. The blue ones are slept on. Yeah, you think so? I th I thought so. Like we're not even here anymore. We sold out almost instantly. Yeah. All right, bro. All right, I appreciate man. it. Bless up, man. Yeah, thank you, bro. No Let's go. All right, guys, what is going on? So I am finally back home and I am super excited and stoked that I was able to get a pair for retail. So I really wanted to go over because I don't, this is my first time ever joining or trying to get a Yeezy for retail in the US. This is my first time and I just happened to get one. So I'd like to go over on how I was able to successfully avail a pair of Yeezys for retail. And basically all I did was join as many raffles as I could possibly find around my area and through online as well. I joined 10 raffles from different stores to be exact. I got one from Ubik. I joined the Ubik raffle. I also joined Commonwealth raffle. I also joined Finish Lines two store raffles, Foot Locker's two store raffles, Finish Line app raffle, Foot Locker app raffle uh what else um georgetown ubic uh major dc uh hype beast also did a raffle for that uh and also did a raffle for that so i joined all of those so 10 imagine 10 raffles i joined and only one was picked so very happy and grateful that i was able to get one from finish line store raffle and my conclusion for picking up yeezys in the u.s is i've come to realize that when it's an electronic raffle, like an app raffle, it's almost nearly impossible to win because the margins are just so freaking uh, low for that because in, in an app raffle, basically anyone can join so you have so you're going up against thousands of people literally so as to a store raffle they have a set amount of tickets that they can give out for example finish line as well as foot locker i believe so once they exceed that tickets they'll close the raffle immediately so your best bet really are store raffles just because of the amount of tickets they give out and that's 
honestly what happened with my finish line. I was able to get one through a store raffle. Confirmed app, um, finish line app, Foot Locker app, all those apps, Cop Day, and all those other apps that I joined, absolutely nothing, man. Like, after three seconds, it was literally gone that fast. Almost impossible. So your best bet for joining raffles are in-store raffles. So I do hope that more stores continue to do these store raffles. So yeah, here they are. Let's go ahead and open these up. Let's go. Here you guys have it, the 350 box, as you guys already seen. Something new to me are the box details. The Southeast Asian box details are completely different to the US version. So this is my first time actually seeing it like this. All right, so let's go ahead and get the sneakers out the box. Give you guys a first look. Voila, check those out. I do apologize if the coloring was a little bit off, but here is a closer look at this sneaker. You guys know how I do unboxings. Let's go ahead and give you guys a quick 360 of the sneaker. A lot of people are dubbing this as their favorite colorway for the 350s. I, however, am going to stick with the Beluga 2.0s for my favorite colorway so far. Check this out. This is what the back looks like. Flip that over for you guys, sorry about that. And the outsole. It is a lot bluer than I expected, but nevertheless, still a dope sneaker. And that pretty much does it for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. I appreciate you guys coming along with me to pick up the Yeezys for retail. Let me know how you guys feel about these sneakers down below. And if you guys want to keep chopping it up with me, you guys can always find me on all my social medias, especially, especially Instagram. And that does it for me for this video. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out, guys. That's why I'm giving you my sideline. Sideline.